Former presidential spokesperson Harry Roque says the disbarment complaint against him is, quote, a desperate act of attention. Now here's the report. Aside from an arrest order from Congress, former presidential spokesperson Harry Roque is now also facing a disbarment case. That was filed by former acting cabinet secretary attorney Melvin Matibag. In an interview with a big story, Matibag explained that he did this to protect their legal profession. You will look at it. Abogado ka eh, magaling ka na lawyer. Then you will come out with a pronouncement na hindi naman validated or worse is kung ginawa mo pa to, pineke mo. According to Matibag, the disbarment case stems from Roque's social media post, including a deepfake video of President Bongbong Marcos supposedly using drugs. Roque earlier denied that he was the source of the video. It doesn't matter whether he is the original na nag-post or kung siya gumawa, but it looks like siya yung una na kiklaim niyan eh. In response, Roque called the complaint against him a desperate act of attention. He added that the authenticity and the content of the video deserve widespread discussion. Roque also noted that posting it on social media is protected by his right to free speech. Sabi niya kasi, uh, kailangan daw malaman ng tao. Yes, but they will also have a responsibility as he is a lawyer, he has a responsibility to make sure that any information that comes from him eh, oh. is vetted Kasi and verified. Kasi parang AI, di ba? AI generated oh, oh. yung Tsaka, ano, alam mo naman, fake, fake pala. Kung regular person yan, you wanna share something like that and, and uh -huh. caption it with a joke. Baka pwede pang pag-usapan yan. Pero he is a lawyer, he was a former cab a government official and you're posting something and claiming na it, it, itong presidente nyo, ito ang presidente nyo, parang gano'n oh. ang messaging niya. So, that is very unbecoming daw of a lawyer, di ba? So, di, di ba nga ang mga attorney, mga lawyer, they're, they're beholden by very strict and Meron stringent rules. Meron moral, silang morality clause. Oh, If oh. you can remember, there's a certain lawyer here na na-disbar na siya dahil uh, meron siyang kabit. Mm. Bawal yun, di ba? Meron. Yun. Eh, itong si uh, former spokesperson attorney Harry Roque, sabi niya, uh, meron daw siyang source sa loob ng House of Representatives, of course, hindi niya sinabi kung sino, na talagang he was being targeted by these people because of this video that he uh, released, yung nga, yung uh, tungkol nga. Well, kaya, if you're being targeted, I don't doubt that. You're being targeted kasi you're on the other side of the political fence. Pero why did you give them ammo? But nung binigyan ng bala para i-target ka, dapat malinis ang ginagawa mo. And in the first place, whether you're targeted or not, you're not supposed to be endorsing, even being near videos like that. Diba? You have to uphold the highest uh, in, in, character more. Dapat you have to be, be, ano, have the highest form of integrity in your ano, profession. Mm -hmm. Kaya... Ano nga yung ano nila na ang nakakagulat lang dito kasi ang nag-file ng disbarment case is magkasama si, yan. ano attorney uh -oh. uh, Matibag which is magkasama sila before under Cap the Duterte si administration yes, former cabinet secretary And we all know si under uh, the Duterte administration yeah. at attorney Harry Roque former spokesperson yeah, oh, uh -oh. Oh. So, eh, wala na siya sa PDP laban ngayon eh, si uh, attorney uh, Matibag. Yeah. Wala na siya. Tapos yung asawa naman niya, uh, parang recently nanumpa sa, ano, sa lakas. So, mm. dating magkakampi, magka uh, working under a uh, under Duterte administration, ngayon ay eh, nag-aaway na. Pero, yun nga, supposedly ang disbarment case ay, disbarment case, ay confidential. Kaya yeah. hindi daw niya masyado mailabas lahat ng mga uh, details of the case pero one of which lang daw itong pag-post ng uh, video, supposedly deepfake video ni uh, Pangulong Bongbong Marcos. So abangan natin kasi marami talaga mga issue ang pinupukol against sa uh, uh, former spokesperson na Tony Harry Roque. Siya ba ay magpapakita na finally but then again, Um, his daughter filed a writ of Amparo case mm. against uh, para ma mapigilan nga ang House of Representatives na siya ay makompel to attend uh, the ongoing Quadcom hearing. At aabangan pa natin yung mga susunod na kabanata.